Nigeria they observe World Hand Hygiene Day. Independent Broadcasting Association the beg for COVID-19 palliative. And since it's the Torchlight 5G technology. Presidential Task Force for COVID-19 work make them to make law for future disease we will come. Good evening and welcome to Wazubia Max TV. This is not time we will be the young to re-give you. As it take happen, my name is Adati Omupi. Sharply for inside the first story where I carry come, as Nigeria don't follow other countries to celebrate World Hand Hygiene Day, World Health Organization now don't come out when they raise alarm on top of this importance of better washing of hand for inside the world. Still on top of that matter, they see and say they're very important because they will prevent plenty of yama and disease for inside hospitals and different places. Dr. Mashidi Somweti will be the Regional Director of Africa World Health Organization. Now they learn about the importance of this washing of hands, especially for this coronavirus period. Ogamu Weti now been talked this one inside the message where we say them carry come from WHO Regional Office inside Brazzaville for Congo on Tuesday. The World Health Hygiene Day, now that they celebrate every 5th of May for every year to fit raise attention now on top of the hand washing for inside hospitals and how we fit protect health workers from disease them. The theme of this year now save lives and clean your hands. And for inside another story where we carry come, the Independent Broadcasting Association of Nigeria don't come out the Begobonge government to help them with money for news story people on top of this COVID-19 Wahala where we say it day ground. Still on top of this matter, according by talk paper where we say the joint body secretary been released, that's now Guy Murray Bruce. He come out when they talk say some of the help where we say them need now to fit pay small money to private media joint body so that they no go sack sack their staff. The second the back federal government they make them give tax to media joint body plus including banks to release loan give company them. Still on top of everything where they happen, as in been the twirly give government where they work to fight coronavirus. Yes, association can they tell government they make them start serious training to teach people against the virus and to provide capital to take run their business. And we enter for inside Senate to we as the matter be seen, it don't start to the touch light, the matter of fifth generation network, where people they call 5G for inside Nigeria. As the matter still be, then put mat on top of this matter. As the senator where they represent Anambra Central, that's now Uche Ikunife been raised the matter for inside their meeting on Tuesday. The Senate is concerned that uncertainty Surrounding whether or not the 5G network has been launched in Nigeria will continue to fuel the speculations and rumors concerning the deployment of 5G network and its effect on the citizens of Nigeria. The Senate is further concerned about the massive infrastructural upgrade as has never been seen before, which will follow the launching of 5G network in Nigeria. For instance, for the deployment of 5G network in urban areas, the providers have to install a strong radiating mobile communications antenna approximately every 100 meters, producing what has been described as the radiant tsunami, uh, sorry, radiation tsunami, and taking up to a 1,000 fold increase in the transmission power. And still on top of the Tory, Senate President Dathna Ahmed Lawan, we've been there on top of the matter in consent committees on top of communications, health, science and technology, plus including ICT and cyber crimes, to do more serious touch lighting for the 5G network for inside Nigeria and how we go take affect Nigerians. Still after the send the committee finished, he answered the committee supposed report back after four weeks. And still for inside another story, as everything still the hot, the bill on top control of infectious disease bill 2020, where they cause trouble. We had say don't pass second reading for inside the House of Representatives last week, and then don't introduce them, carry go, seen it. The bill now where we say Enugu not Senator Chukuka Otaze been the sponsor. If they come under different title, will be National Health Emergency Bill 2020. You see, what I want to tell you is that uh, this bill, I have started working on this bill for over two months now. You know, so over two, over, over, over two, over two months we have been on this issue. You know, trying to make sure this is so. I got this bill. I forwarded it to the uh, the Minister of Health. I forwarded it to the NCDNC, NCDC, 
I forwarded it to uh, the Attorney General's uh, uh, for the professional office to look at all those things. Over two months, you know, they were, um, that I heard that the House of Reps is there. It's just a new thing. I have been on working on this thing for a long time now. And still on top of the Tory, another senator, Enugu senator, that's now Ike Ikwere Madu, he been kicked against him after he didn't pass him for first reading. Oga Ikwere Madu be asked for the photocopy of the bill. We can make the Senate President Ahmed Lawan to come out and talk to him. He made share for all the senators. The Senate President talks to them to take the second reading inside next week. I'm entitled to know possibly the details of any bill being presented in this Senate through the distribution of the gazette. <coughs> This bill has all been read now. I would like to know the details and possibly receive a gazetted copy. And I'm sure those of my colleagues who would like to see the bill also want to have copies as well. Recall that we have a controversial bill in the House of Reps that has to do with the Quarantine uh, Act amendment. So I want to ensure that we don't go the same route that's happening in the House of Reps. So I would like to know the details, probably a summary of what this bill is all about or possibly get a copy of the gazetted uh, uh, form of this particular bill, so that I'll be sure of what it's all about. They enable me to prepare my response, or possibly my contributions to this bill when it comes up for second reading. Thank you. And for inside another story where we carry come, Chairman of Presidential Tax Force on Top COVID-19, that's Nabot Mustafa. He don't come out now when they tell the National Assembly. So we them bring out plan on how they go fit stake prepare Nigeria for future body matter wahala we go come. May them for make the health sector for inside the country today very cajad. Oga Mustafa, they talk this one on Tuesday. As him been the young with members of the House of Representatives. Him come they talk say coronavirus don't really worry our health system for inside the country. 9th of April, 2020. Our nation is at war against a very dangerous and seen and ubiquitous enemy. And all hands must be on deck to successfully prosecute the war. In addition to providing the kind of leadership already demonstrated, the National Assembly finds itself in the unique position of history to do the following, though not exhaustive. One, develop a legislative framework to prepare Nigeria for any future pandemic. Two, develop a legislative framework for reforming and transforming our healthcare systems. Three, strengthen the legislative framework for economic growth through domestic manufacturing. And four, deepen the legislative oversight during this pandemic and beyond. Five, six, pass legislations that will further ease the ability of the executive to cushion the impact of the economic decline. And seven, the part of the community mobilization. And still on top, the Tori Oga Mustafa Kontok said the tax force now they work with the state government on the ways to take contain the virus. If they come out, they talk say they want to arrange intensive care units and isolation centers for inside the country, plus including capacity building for body matter workers them to improve their ability to take reduce the effect of the virus. The SGF now come the talk will be said them column to come explain the deaths where they happen for inside Kano State. It talks say the PTF one engage about 3,300 informants for house to house search for report uh, to report cases of COVID-19 for inside Kano State and say NCDC now they plan to test more people from 400 people to 2,000 people per day. In Comat now they want say Kano State don't they become the place where we say COVID-19 cases don't they plenty. And for inside another story where we carry come, Governor Samuel Autumn don't come out now come confirm second positive case of COVID-19 for inside Benue State. He say the person now they work with Nigeria Drug Law Enforcement Agency. And as the matter be, he talks say the person just come back from inside Kanu State some days ago. The governor been talked to Tory people on top of this matter this morning. And he talks say the State Action Committee on top of coronavirus don't they trace people where they say them get contact with the man. And them don't isolate him, plus including saying don't start to receive treatment. He say talks say he come out now come announce who the person be so that it go be very easy to trace all the people where they say they don't get contact with the person. Governor Otto and Contox said the State Action Committee now for COVID-19 said they go meet tomorrow when they for put eye on top partial lockdown and to look for other things where they say they fit do to prevent the virus making no spread past as it be for inside the state. He can they promise they no go abandon anybody we get coronavirus for inside Benue State. 
And we shall finally move enter inside Nasarawa State as we hear say Governor Abdullah Hisuli. He don't come out contour say Nasarawa State don't get one more positive case of COVID-19. As they announced this one, carry gift to people for stakeholders review meeting for government house inside Lafia on Tuesday. Governor Suli talks to the patients now they do delivery service with Nigeria Center for Disease Control. And as a matter be in they take treatments for Federal Medical Center inside Kefi. In see come out come out say the patients now, now person where be say they come from Nasara State and him they live for inside Ado for Karu local government area of the state. Governor Sule talks say the patients being catch the disease as him being the work. This one now come make a um, total number of 12 people will get COVID-19 for inside the state. Then yes, inside the 12 cases, one patient now member of a Nasara State House of Assembly will die last week. And still on top, another matter with the ground. The Senate now on Tuesday talks say them will do serious touch lighting on top of the one where them allege say management committee of the Niger Delta Development Commission being misused money. Still on top of the Tory, the lawmakers now come out when they talk say they want the management committee to explain how they take spend 40 billion naira within the last three months. On top of this matter, Senate can set up ad hoc committee now where B Senator Senator Olubumi at Detumbi now go be the leader for inside the committee to touch light this matter and still report back after four weeks. Then being decided to do this touch lighting after Senator George Sekibo been raised the matter. And still on top of this matter, the talks here as in the yarn for the matter, Senator Bala Ibin Na La, plus including Ajibola Bashiru, being yarn as a Senate president, Ahmed Lau and Court Toxi, made them form ad hoc committee on top of this matter. And for inside another story where we carry come, the Speaker of the House of Representatives, that's my Femi Bajabia Miller, he don't come out now and deny say the infectious control a disease bill for 2020. Seen a product of in documents by foreign interests where BC they want to take ton Nigerians to guinea pigs for medical research and to collect their fundamental human rights. With everything where they happen, Ogabwa Jabia Milayan this one before they start meeting on Tuesday. In C come at con they talk say the bill now where BC then carry come last week Tuesday. Seen to address the limits where BC a day for law where they currently operate sake of the Wahala where BC say it don't cause. When some Nigerians now come come out come the alleged say the bill wants by forced vaccination. Still on top of the matter, the speaker come out come talk say the current law no they let federal government and the Nigeria Center for Disease Control to take action to prevent infectious disease and say the management of public health emergencies for inside Nigeria. That's why it needs day for this new bill. And still on top of the matter, in context of the control of infectious disease bill, now something where we say them need to do public hearing for, where we say stakeholders will come out coin yarn to improve the bill before them go finally talk about them. Um, and we move come out from inside that so we enter another one way we carry come. We as a cardinal state government now don't confirm say 70 two COVID-19 patients, nine day they treat for inside the state. Inside talk paper where we say the talk person of Governor Nasiru Enrufai being carried come, that's Namuiwa at DKA. In talk say 67 of the patients now now Alamajiri children, we just come back from Kanu State. At DKA, you can't explain say the seven other cases, now people where we say they don't travel outside Kaduna State or their contact. And out of the number, they told say two policemen now where we say they take treatment for inside the state infection disease control. Say they follow for inside. In second, they talk say since where they report the first case for inside March 28, say Kaduna don't discharge eight patients and now only one person, nine don't die before in test results being come out positive. Inside all this one, they talk say 81 cases, nine Kaduna states don't get so far. And say now 72 active cases, nine them get. We shall probably move and enter inside the next story. The police COVID-19 restriction enforcement team, we hear say they don't turn back one motorway carry like 13 passengers from Akure for inside on Joe State. And as a matter be, now FCT Police Commissioner Balachi Roma, now been lead the operation. They may catch them for carrying more along the Kubwazuba Expressway. And Minister of Information and Culture will be Ogalai Mohamed. He confirms that the Chinese health workers now for inside Nigeria, they do work for inside isolation centers. Still on top of this one, the minister now will talk this one on Monday for inside PTF COVID-19 press briefing. He now talk about the particular isolation centers where them they do the work. But as the matter still be, in come out control, say the Chinese people now, say them they do well, and say all of them been test negative for coronavirus. In see contact, say them they arrange all the equipment where we say them carry come. 
And still on top matter of COVID-19, for inside another story, Nigeria Center for Disease Control, that now NCDC, they don't come out to confirm 245 new cases of COVID-19 for inside the country. And the total number of cases don't reach 2,802. For inside the new cases, the Yancey Lagos get 76 new cases. Why Casina State gets 37. Another state where BC then still gets cases, Najigawa with 32 cases. Kanu gets 23, and FCT gets 19 cases. The Yancey Borunu gets 18, Edo gets 10, Bauchi gets 9, Adamawakon gets 6 cases. Nancy Toxi, Oyo, and Ogun State get 5 5 cases each, while Ekiti, Oshun, Benui, Niger, and Zamfara State can get 1 1 case. NCDC comes to come at Quantosity. The total number of patients where we say they don't discharge now 417 and say 93 patients nine don't die of COVID 19. And for inside another story where we carry come, we have say over 100 people now nine don't die within the last 10 days for inside Hadaji local government area of Jigawa State. On top of this story, the special assistant to the local council chairman on top media, that's now Sani Kakabori, nine been come out now going here for inside channel television. And in talks, the average of 10 people where we say they don't reach like 50 years, nine they die every day for the past 10 days. In the come out going, they talk, say the government now don't form five man committee. To touch light the matter, made them for know the action where BC them go take. And the state chairman for COVID 19 task force, now West TB, the commissioner for health, that's now Dr. Abba Zakari. Now they talk this one. According to him, Dr. Mahmoud Abdul Wahab, plus including Shehu Muhammad and Yusuf Hakimi, plus Shehu Suli, and representative of World Health Organization, now go chair the committee. In the context, say the committee now go submit their reports within the next three days. And for inside another story where we carry come out, President Momo Dubwari don't come out now come they tell government and the people of Zamfara State plenty sorry and no sake of the death of uh, the civilian governor of old Sokoto State, that now Dr. Garba Nadama. Inside of paper where we say senior special assistant on top media and publicity that Nagarba Shea will be in CARICOM, President Buhari talks say him no happy for the death of Dr. Garba at all at all. Say in Sabi history where we and say him PhD idea that it is where we say them see they used to teach to students and re researchers for inside the country till today. The president come out come talk say Ogan Nadama where we say he don't die. You know they popular only because of politics but because of the contribution where we say don't make for inside the country. And now with this story, we will move, come out, enter inside business and sports. No go anywhere. And for inside business story, we have a letter from President Muhammad Dubwari where they request say make the House of Representatives approve 850 billion naira loan from the domestic capital market. We have them read down for inside their meeting on Tuesday. As the matter still be, this letter explains to them go use the loan for critical projects for the 2020 budget. Make we check within day for sports. <laughs> And for inside sports story, before Super Ego striker that's na Ike Chuko Uche, that as the matter be in belief say Villa real player Samuel Chukweze they enjoy in football with the new with the yellow submarines and make him no hurry at all to come out from the Spanish side. As the matter still be, Chukweze now they always they present for Villa real teams since where we say him appear for the first time for inside 2018. And the answer take of him performance now make him follow for the 2019 Golden Boy Award where we say Matis the leads of Juventus been winning. This is now auditory where we carry come give you this evening. But before I go, make a reminder of all the tori that we've been lined up for front. I've been telling you see Nigeria they observe World Hand Hygiene Day. An independent broadcasting association they beg for COVID-19 palliative. And we see tell you see seeing it's a touchlight 5G technology. Presidential task force for COVID-19 what made them make law for future disease we go show face. My country people now was over Max TV9 we still day inside and as it take happen now just young give you. My name na Adati Omupe. Good evening.